Hey, happy Tuesday morning, guys. It's Teresa with Critters Crochet. And I wanted to come on today and wish you a happy Tuesday. And um, you can see by, if you look out my, this window here, you can see the sun shining. Yesterday was completely just gray and yucky and cold and bleh outside. And um, I'm in West Tennessee. And... Uh, Today it's sunshiny and um, a little cool this morning, but that's supposed to warm up. And uh, what's crazy is I've got to get out and get some errands run here in just a little bit because they're expecting us to get some pretty nasty weather late this afternoon and on into the evening. Um, they're watching, the weather people are watching for tornadoes. Now, in our area, and that's going through Texas and Arkansas, um, Louisiana, I think Mississippi and Georgia, and Georgia, and then Tennessee, Kentucky, and on up. But they said Tennessee and Kentucky may just get some high winds and floods, but they're still watching for potential potential tornadoes. So, uh, and I'm really worried because my daughter lives in South Haven, Mississippi, which is just outside of Memphis. <laughs> And they are calling for tornadoes coming through there. And so I'm really watching the weather <laughs> to keep an update on that. Uh, but I remember, I keep forgetting this. And Heather from Strings and Threads, I'm sorry. I keep forgetting to mention my Mondays, uh, Moody Monday. So I'm going to show this today. Um, I contacted um, our guidance counselor at our local school. And it's where I retired from, where I used to teach. And she said, not needing a whole lot, but she said, if you could make three girls' hats and a couple of boys' hats and some gloves to go with it, we would really appreciate it. So um, I found these patterns on Pinterest, and I could not tell you who the designer is or anything, but like I said, I go to Pinterest a lot for different stuff. But I've got three girls' hats already made. Of, with this this is made from the um ice cream and i can't remember the number hold on just a second here we go it's the um lion brands ice cream roving yarn and it's the double bubble is the color and i love how the different how it's how it shaded differently on each one so i'm going to make some little pom-poms i think i'm going to do like a peach color on this uh, on this one or wait a white one on this one a brown one on this one and then a peach color on this one and uh this is going to go to these are going to go to three little girls and i just have one of the little boys this is just simple double crochet and then about three rows of single on the bottom so this is going to be a little boy's hat and i've got one more little boy hat to make and then she said if I could make some gloves to go with them, that would be great. So I've tried gloves in the past, and I never could get them to work out. I don't know what I do wrong, but I just never can get them to come out right. But now that I've crocheted for a while and I've gotten a little bit better, I'm going to try the gloves again and see if I can get some gloves made. But today I'm going to go stop by my local little yarn shop Excuse me, my eye is really itching me this morning. But I'm going to go by my local yarn shop. They open in about an hour. And I'm going to go by there and see if I've got some yarn. That crazy, um, what is it, uh, Premier, um, Premier Parfait Chunky that I'm trying to make those bears with. <laughs> and I've it's been ordered since... Oh, for weeks. And so I'm going to go by there and see if they've got that in. And then I need some more um, of that Lydia's number 10 thread to do the earrings. So I'm going to go by there today and pick that up so I can get these orders finished. And um, yeah, that's what my day looks like today. Then I've got to run by and buy my mom's. I've got some dishes of hers that she had brought things over in for Thanksgiving. So I've got to return her dishes to her. And so got a little bit to do today and then back home before the weather starts getting funky and get myself hunkered down. Uh, woo, excuse me.
excuse me, <laughs> that came up all of a sudden, but I need to get that taken care of so we can hunker down and be in the house for tonight. So just a real quick video to show you what I've been working on. And um, yeah, I'm going to finish up, hopefully be able to get that yarn today. I am so sorry. Excuse me. I don't know what brought the sneeze. I have not sneezed all morning. And I get on here and I start sneezing. Whatever. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm hoping to get all that yarn today, finally, and finish up these orders. I have the bears to finish. I have the earrings to work on. And then um, my daughter's mother-in-law asked me to do one of those hand. I showed y'all way back the yarn. But I've got to get that hand knitted. Um, Afghan done and get that to her somehow. I don't know how, but I'm going to get that to her somehow. So a lot to do. Um, my husband and son are doing a great job of helping me keep this house clean since I did a major cleanup for Thanksgiving. They're really helping me keep things clean. So I'm not having to do a lot of housework right now. I can just sit down and crochet and get things done. So, um, that's my plan for today. And so hopefully in the next, <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> I am so sorry. I guess I need to go get something to drink. <laughs> so hopefully in the next day or two, I'm going to have a tutorial up for you. And um, yeah, that's my day today. So I hope you guys are having a terrific Tuesday. If you are new and just now watching my channel, I would love it if you would subscribe and make sure to hit that notification bell. Like this video and comment, guys. It really helps me out a lot. So um, I'm going to get out of here and get my errands done before the weather gets too weird and crazy. And I will talk to you guys again tomorrow. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye, guys.